Hey what is going on everyone this is Wicked and today I will show you how to get a full black team on your Galaxy S8 or Galaxy S8 Plus. What do I mean by a full black team? Well almost every Samsung app is themed in a pure black color along with the user interface. Even the notification background cards are themed in black. Now the pure black is complemented by the beautifully colored icons from Samsung's UI which will make the experience so much better. Along with this I also changed the launcher to Nova Launcher and installed Wicons so that the overall look of the device will be awesome. This theme which I will install requires some modifications, but you won't need a root in order to run it. Take in mind that since it is not a theme you will find in Samsung's theme store, sometimes even with all the modifications I will show you, it will be automatically reverted back to a stock theme. I'll talk about this later in the video. Another thing to be taken into consideration is that you won't be able to open Samsung Teams after you install this theme, because it will automatically detect that the theme is not legit and revert back to stock. That's the main idea. So if you want to change the wallpaper you will need to get a new launcher like Nova Launcher and use their wallpaper system. You can choose from different accents of black and different notification background styles. I will include every one in the description so you will choose what you will like. For the sake of description the black theme is a pure black theme and the dark theme is a more grey material one. The ones with the dark notif extension will have black notification background cards. Both of them look amazing, but I'll go with the black theme. Install the apk file then open up themes application, go and set it by clicking free trial. Now follow these instructions carefully. Go into settings, about phone. Software information and click build number 5 to 7 times until you activate developer options. Then go back to times and click developer options. Go into running services and find two apps, themes and Samsung themes and click stop on both of them. Make sure they don't display anymore. Then go to cache processes and repeat the process. Stop both apps. Then go back into settings app, go into app section and search for Samsung themes. Force close the app, go to storage and clear the data and cache. The following step is optional. If you want to spend two bucks on an app called BK Disabler, which works on no rooted Samsung device in order to permanently disable all the team services, then download it, open it, find the same two packages, drill into their services by clicking the service button, disable all, clear data for both and disable them. Either way, afterwards you will have to reboot your device. After you've done that, you will have your theme installed. Enjoy! If you want to change the theme, you will need to manually revert all the steps you've followed. Re-enable the services, uninstall the theme, install another one since they all had the same signature, etc. Anyways, that was it for today. If you want to see more theming tutorials or a major production on how to transform theme your Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus, make sure you write down in the comments section and subscribe to my channel. As always, until next time, take care. Wicked is out. Bye-bye.